Hey YouTubers, Mike Boris with the Mike Boris channel. Today let's talk about the bytes table and hopefully this will answer some of the questions you have as far as how many megabytes are in a kilobyte, how many gigabytes are in a terabyte, etc. So let's start with one bit is called a binary digit and 8 bits equals one byte. 1000 bytes equal one kilobyte or 1024 bytes equals one kilobyte and that just depends on which definition or standard table you go with. That's a whole different discussion. 1,000 kilobytes equal 1 megabyte, 1,000 megabytes equal 1 gigabyte, and 1,000 gigabytes equals 1 terabyte. That's the Mac Daddy as far as storage that uh, I'm going to show in this example. So let's talk about a few examples. Number one, you have a 16 gigabyte phone, and for whatever reason, you're just curious and you want to know how many megabytes that is. As we just mentioned up here, 1 gigabyte is equal to 1,000 megabytes. So we take that 16 multiply it by a thousand that gives us the sixteen thousand number of megabytes for that example example number two you've got a hundred twenty eight gigabyte computer and same calculation you're going to use multiply it by a thousand that's going to give you one hundred twenty eight thousand megabytes or point one two terabytes example number three you're in the market to buy a usb drive maybe for backing up some photos or documents on your computer and the example I've got is a 250 gigabyte USB drive online for $50 and I'm going to hop over to the internet on eBay here is a SanDisk Cruiser Glide 256 gigabyte USB and as far as putting that into perspective see what you can store 256 gigabyte allows you to store 14,400 photos plus 10.6 hours of video Plus, if you're a music fan, 16,000 songs, as well as 64 gigabyte remaining space for Office files. So, that's a lot of storage. Next thing I want to show you is, if you go to Google.com, and you enter in how many megabytes in one gigabyte, it's going to pull up this digital storage graph here or calculator and as we can see we just talked about one gigabyte equals 1000 megabytes we can change this to 128 equals the 128,000 that is the reference with the example of the computer and so forth so the cool thing about this you can change the selection and calculate anything you want to as far as storage I hope this helps. Like the video, subscribe to the channel. If you're a subscriber, you'll be notified every video we upload. You'll be able to stay in tune with us, and that will be awesome. We have a lot of cool videos uploaded on our channel. Check those out. They may benefit you. Thanks again for watching.